All right, so after that D14 video, this is a little bonus, I guess. I uh, was putting it back in the, the the shed here, right where that my wide front N45 is sitting. And I had a couple tractors in here, and then they were just kind of sprudled everywhere. I said, you know what? I'm just going to spend a couple minutes, get them all in line. So I got my WD. That's my grandpa's black 45. He didn't want that at his place anymore. So we dropped it off yesterday, and that was sitting right where I'm standing here in front of the doorway. And uh, it's a pain when a tractor is not going to take pulling for a, couple, a little while. It's in the middle of the door. Uh, my dad's unstyled WC. My C, uh, that's at uh, WD. 45. It's a WD with a 45 motor that runs eh, halfway decent. Uh, my little 712 one more RCG. 19 wide front n45 by pole super heavy uh wd back there in the corner d10 there's that's my 712 or 712 720 alice lawnmower uh bad own it own an engine in it so eventually i'll get repowered with something uh my ca got the wc that my tricycle 14 as you can see how tight I was able to get her in there tricycles are nice for that uh, My 16 9 45 and then a 17 series 4 That needs some TLC so just so You guys see what I'm working with here. I have a building that is full of Alice and I'll get them lined up here also for the winter, but it's a pain when you're Say you want to take that 45 and that 45 like I do a lot and you got that WD Or that 45 and that WD sitting here in the doorway You have to get them running and get them out of the way first now pretty much every tractor. I'm gonna take That's not gonna go with a different tractor is already out so Yeah, because this weekend is uh, Transfer sled pull so I'm gonna take my WD at 4,000 and that 16,945 for 5,000. So, she, nice lighter load than usual. So, yeah, if this, this is a little bonus content. So, thanks for watching and have a good one, guys.